Right, ladies and gentlemen, although it's not dated, this book on, on sort of psychic um, phenomena uh, or seances, basically, um, is, is, I believe, um, dated from 1930. Uh, the binding is in decent condition with the gold sort of blocked on the spine, uh, and it's called Psychic Certainties, collected and arranged by H.F. Prevost Battersby. Um, and it's basically about the main phenomena that you would expect at a, a, a sort of seance or to, in, to be involved in um, the world of seances. Um, uh, it has sections on clairvoyance, uh, the, the advent of metaphysics, clairvoyance, the clairvoyant, psychometry, clairvoyant pathology, traveling clairvoyance, precognition, premonition, telekinesis, ectoplasm, psychic force, materialization, the sensitive, the metamorphoses of matter, air, fire, and water, and then there's an index. And it's all about uh, individual cases of, of, of various materializations, um, specific reports, specific um, some sightings at seances of spirits, etc. It's all very technical stuff. It's written from the sort of insider's uh, point of view. The chapter on ectoplasm is particularly uh, um, interesting. It talks about, um, you know, it, it being uh, sometimes as, as soft as a vapor of cloud and sometimes as hard as an iron bar and being or, or being this strange sort of gloopy uh, fluid that issues. It says, where is it? Here we go. Um, there's no, there isn't any uniformity in the manifestation of ectoplasm. It may appear as white or luminous vapor or seem to condense like snowflakes from the air or it may exude like a glutinous liquid from any part of the medium's frame. It may be visible or tangible or, or be neither. It may be soft as a cloud or hard as a bar of iron, etc., etc. It may appear out of out of clocks, it may lift tables, it may do all sorts of things, it may appear in various shapes. Strange, spooky stuff. Seances from the point of view of somebody who's very convinced that they um, uh, are efficacious. There we are. Unusual psychic book, dated, uh, or not dated rather, but dating from 1930, and I think a first edition. Thanks very much indeed. Bye.